Well, man, where are you going? You said you wanted to be in the video. Not this time. Not this time? All right, that's my wife, guys. And uh, she's done. Uh, the Specialized I just uploaded, final version of it, once again, Specialized Expedition Sport. I just remembered my brother-in-law has the comfort version of this, and it's a workhorse. I Honestly, it just like, it just hit, and he uses his all the time before he got his new Fuji. He did several rides on it, and he had a lot of fun on his. Uh, his is a one by. this is a 3 by, but uh, pretty much it's the same thing, shocks in the front, Quilm in the front, high rise bars. His did have the shock saddle, which we took that off. Uh, it does have the shocks in the front, which never replaced. It just kind of stood there. So let's see what I did to this one, guys. Uh, let's see. So I switched out the tires to these Kendas, and these are 26 times 1.50. So they're a little bit more cushioner. So it's just, it's not going to be as fast, but she'll get you there. And, like, you know, that's what I'm saying. Like, guys, like, understand what the bike is going to do for you. And then either A, buy the bike according to that or build the bike according to that. This one for a grocery getter, a commuter around town. This one is just going to kill it. Uh, and uh, let's see what size she is. I think she's a, so she is a large. She's a 21 size, 21 inch frame here to here. And you have the shock, so you can't go that much lower here either. So it is a grip frame. It is a large frame. I'm in there for fifteen dollars. I mean, twenty five dollars. Twenty five dollars. You know, I got used tires, which look pretty much new. Um, did absolutely nothing else. I put matching grips on her because she didn't have them. Uh, she didn't have one. My bad. There you go. She didn't have one. So I just ripped some used grips I had down there, and I made them fit. And now, you know, it's a 3 by 8 setup. She's done. She's going to be put to sale pretty soon. And not much more to say. You know? Once it, just keep an eye what's out there, guys. You know? Do some work. You know? Even if you buy a cheap bike, you can't mess it up. Because even if you got to refix you got to fix it anyway. So just take it to the bike shop if you mess it up that bad. You know? I'm just like... Cycling is not expensive if you if you aim for a mid to low end bike if you aim for a high end bike carbon fiber yeah that's expensive but this bike right here will do an awesome job for you know slow group rides anything under 15 miles an hour this bike will completely be able to handle that if you're in better shape maybe even 20 miles an hour but uh just look at what's out there guys you know your still cycles out